This is just a quick screencast to show you how to use Google Classroom. So first you click on your classroom's name and then this is your stream. You can tell up here at the top you're in the stream tab. So this is mostly just used for announcements from your teachers. You got announcements from Mr. Ferguson, announcements from myself, announcements from Ms. Priest. Okay. Any of the teachers connected to your classroom can use this announcements tab to give you announcements. Over here on the left hand side, you have um, your upcoming things that are due. So you have your I Ready Math with Mr. Ferguson is due today. You have your chapter and the answers to the questions for me are due today. And then Ms. Priest has assigned you something for music due on Sunday. If you click over here to the class work tab, you have everything broken down by topics. You have the topics are very big right here. You also have the topics over here on the sides. So you can click on these and it'll take you to any of the topics. Or if you go to all topics, you can view them all. Important links is just resources for you. Okay, this is nothing that's due. It's just here if you need them. Mr. Ferguson has similarly um, is going to be uploading inspirational songs. Again, you don't need to turn these in. They're just here for you. However, Ms. Priest has some assignments here. So for example, if we click on the assignment, we can then click view assignment. We can see the instructions up here. We can see the resources she's given us to click on right here and right here. And then down here are class comments. An important thing to remember with class comments is that they're public, so anyone can see them, okay? And by the way, all of the teachers get an email anytime you make a class comment, so please make sure they're on topic. This question that Delaney has right here, do we pick a do we take a picture of our work when we're done with it? That's a very good question. And Ms. Priest has answered no. There is a marked as done button to turn it in. When you're ready to turn in your work, you press the mark as done and then it is sent to your teacher. So you can see all of the work that Ms. Priest has assigned you here. And then for myself and Mr. Ferguson, we've broken it down by weeks and then months. So we have all the assignments that are due today and this week. All of the assignments that are due next week do here, okay? These are April-wide assignments that you're not going to press mark is done until the end of April. That's when you're going to turn them in. So again, in order for us to see your work, you have to press this mark is done button or else it won't get sent to your teachers. If you want to send a private comment to your teacher, you can type right here in the private comment box and that'll just go to your teacher. It won't go to everyone. So again, Public comments go here, and public means anyone can see it. Private comments go right here, and that means it's just between you and your teacher. Okay? One more time. Don't forget to press mark is done when you're done. I hope you guys have a great day and that you've had a good first week of remote learning. See you soon.